Good morning, guys. Welcome back to another vlog. Today we are in Lima, <laughs> Peru. I gotta tell you, our first impressions is that it's always foggy. Every morning we wake up, we open the blinds, and what do we see? Nothing. Zero, nothing, nothing at all. <laughs> However, as the day goes on, around 12 p.m., 1 p.m., it clears up to a beautiful day. So hopefully, today is the same. I'm excited because we're gonna go out and explore today and find the best things to do here in Lima. And the first thing that we are going to do is fill up these tummies because we're the starving. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> so we're on our way out, guys. Come Let's with us. Let's go. and we came across this cafe which is called Sofa Cafe and I took a quick peek inside and I fell in love with the decor so we decided to eat here so we're gonna order some breakfast and I'm hoping that it's good so far first impressions of Peru is that it is delicious <laughs> Breakfast hit the spot and now we're off to our next location. And look at this beautiful area. Oh it my god. It's gorgeous. Building gorgeous. Is so colorful. I am loving it so far. <laughs> Lima, we like you. So far so good. Alright guys, we made it to the Bridge of Sighs. Now this is a small wooden bridge that connects one street to the other. And there's a strange myth about this bridge. The myth is that if you and your spouse walk across the bridge while holding your breath, you guys will be together forever. <laughs> and for all you single people, make sure you walk across that bridge while holding your breath because the myth is you will find a significant other. There you go. Let's try it. We're going to do it. Alright, let's go. One, two, three. <gasps> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> it was longer than I thought. It was longer than I thought, about seriously. To breathe, I had to start counting. Yeah. <laughs> it looks like such a short bridge, but once you start crossing with your breath held. Exactly. Woo. It felt like two miles. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right. All right, so, let's walk around and explore a little bit here. It's so pretty yeah, here. There's some murals around, so we're going to go check those out. And just the grounds, it's because it's like a park slash botanical gardens. Yeah. So it's a place you could definitely come and hang. There's a restaurant on the other side. You can grab a, something to eat. Yeah, so, we ate already. <laughs> yeah, we're stuck. So, so we're just going to enjoy the birds and all the, the other beautiful... Exactly. All right. walk through a beautiful colorful tunnel murals <laughs> on both sides of the tunnel on the ceiling on the outside as you can see the photographer behind us is getting ready to set up take Photo pictures shoot i'm next yeah it's a nice place it's really pretty the surrounding area is just covered with murals flowers trees it's so really nice i like it, it. it yeah it truly is i wasn't expecting this much artwork within this specific area the immediate area the bridge is right there so you don't have to go far but, uh, I mean, so far, impressed. So far, Lima, thumbs up. Alright, so look where we end up, right on the beach. Now this is not the normal beach, there's a lot of rocks right here, but 
It's a place where locals and tourists come and hang out. It is so nice here. How did we get here? We actually walked all the way from the Bridge of Sighs. There was a path coming down, another bridge, and voila! And we're here! <laughs> it's such a beautiful view here. I love it. Yeah. beach is sandy. It's nice. This is a regular beach. It sure is. A lot <laughs> I of do families. like the other beach though. The other beach made that sound that she loves. Yes. This one, there are no rocks there at all. It's all sand. No. Yeah, you can take a dip. I won't be taking a dip. The water is 60 degrees Fahrenheit. Yeah. That is cold for me. <laughs> Too cold for us. Oh, for you? Come on, you can do it. So, after a 20 minute walk from that beach all the way over there, <laughs> we're now on what I call like a cliff top walkway where this part of the city is built on cliffs that's over 500 feet above sea level. It is gorgeous up here. Pacific coastline. Oh, stunning. Guys, have you noticed? Within 25 minutes, look how the weather changed. It was sunny while we were down there. I was now, hot and sweaty and you said, it's not cold, but I like staying it's warm. It's a little chilly. So. <laughs> it's a little chilly. But yeah, it was sunny while we were down there. And now the fog has moved in. Like we said, it's, you know, it's like this every day. <laughs> it's awesome. So we are going to start our way along the Malecon and stop at a few locations and enjoy this fantastic, beautiful view. You've been with me all along, all along, always on my side. You've never gone. You've been with me all along And you've been holding on Holding on for so long Where the others would be gone You stayed with me all along You've been with me when I laugh or cry Anywhere I stood, you were standing by With me when I'm fine With me when I'm not With me when I'm giving everything I got With me all along Can you believe the Malecon is almost six miles long? And along the way, you get to come across several parks where you can hang out, have a picnic. Yeah, there are rollerbladers here, bikers, joggers, families just sitting on the grass, eating brunch. Um, it's pretty nice. I love it and we are definitely going to revisit this place again. We're going to walk this place about the full time before we leave. <laughs> yeah, over and over and over again. Because we don't, we're not staying too far from here. In fact, we're staying here. Yeah. In this area. But it's still not far. Well, uh, I would say a five, ten minute walk if that. Depending uh, how fast or slow I walk. <laughs> yeah, lucky us, lucky us. <laughs> So, I don't know which one is next, whether it is the lighthouse or the uh, park for lovers or lovers park or love yeah. park, something like We're that. We're just going to keep walking until we come across one of them. Yeah, let's go. All right. And hopefully we come across a restaurant like really fast. <laughs> Alright guys, we came across this mall, it's called the Larkomar Mall, located on the, the Malecon. It's actually built into the cliffside, 
I mean, literally built into the cliff sides. It has restaurants. I mean, it has everything. It gets beautiful a wall. views, and it has a lot of stores that you would find in the U.S. Yep. Tommy Hilfiger, Gap. I mean, hello. I found Pinkberry. We had yep. some ice cream. There's even a gym here, so it's pretty cool. I mean, it's, it deserves a walkthrough if you're walking the wall. So. And if you want to eat as well, you can also eat here, but I have some place in mind. Okay. Welcome to the Parque of Amor. That's the Park of Love, guys. <laughs> Behind me, you see a statue which depicts two lovers embracing in each other's arms who seem to be kissing forever. <laughs> and would you know that the mayor of this district holds a competition for couples to see who would sustain the longest kiss? Crazy. This park is absolutely lovely. Supposedly, it is inspired by Anthony Gaudet's Park Well in Barcelona. Oh, uh, yes. Yeah, a lot of similarities there, guys. The same wall, the same mosaic tiles. But with yep. a better view. Way better view of the Pacific <laughs> Ocean. Beautiful. All right, like I said, we just got here. So let's go and see what this park is all about. More importantly, let's show you around. You've been with me all along. All along. And now we're at the lighthouse Faro La Marina. It's an active lighthouse which sits above sea level on the Malecon at the Pacific coast. You know what guys? It is the most famous and visited lighthouse here in the country. Amazing. And it's just surrounded by a beautiful park. It's just a nice place to come and chill out. We are loving the <laughs> Malecon. <laughs> yeah, it's just so many different things to see. You can walk this all day and just keep discovering new places. So this man on the top of our list yeah for definitely sure. definitely and i all like you no some blow away in a fair weather gust disappear in a cloud of dust leave you in the rain to rust train your trust say you're pretty good but not good enough the ones you thought you knew well but i guess not well enough Okay, so we made our way to Plaza de Almas. It's a beautiful square where everyone comes to hang out. You can have a bite to eat, grab some ice cream, people watch, and the buildings here are gorgeous. Oh my gosh, this is the reason why I wanted to come here. The cathedral, the government building. Yeah. So beautiful. I'm just staring totally at it. Totally is. Totally is. So, besides people watching, we're gonna go maybe shopping. No, we're gonna grab a bite to eat. <laughs> and get out of the dodge. Lunch time! <laughs> so, let's show you around. take a break and we're gonna visit the Cathedral of Lima and a museum yeah now we're not normally museum people but we're here it's open it's not usually open so we got to check it out plus it looks so beautiful from the outside it it's gotta be pretty inside yes
beautiful in there. It is gorgeous. I love the high ceilings, the furniture, the antique the furniture. Antique, the doors. Everything about that place is beautiful. They even have like a stained glass ceiling. Gorgeous. We actually spent some time in there. <laughs> yeah, we weren't expecting to it be able to so go pretty. in. I actually wanted to sit on one of the sofas, just relax and chill. <laughs> Yeah, but was like, it's no. roped off. Yeah, it was so pretty in there. I really enjoyed it. Yeah, it was beautiful, man. I'm glad we had the opportunity to go in. So now we are going to the other side. I think it's the cathedral church. I'm not too sure. Actually, cathedral museum, it says. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so let's go check that out. this beautiful park and what's the name of this it's called john f kennedy also, also known as <laughs> parque de gatos tons of cats everywhere it looks like the people come out and feed the cats they play with them and cats have a happy life here it is so pretty these parks are like gorgeous i think lima has like lima has about hundreds of parks a lot of parks guys which is great they're all so very well manicured i am absolutely loving the flowers all the yeah. trees right yeah it's, it's so, so nice relaxing. a lot of birds it's just such a nice tranquil place to come and have lunch it is there yeah. are also popcorn vendors yep. artists selling their artwork and there's a beautiful church at one end of the park that they were actually setting up a congregation outside it, it's beautiful it's pretty also once you're done exploring and relaxing and enjoying the park you can go outside of the park and there's so many restaurants, restaurants yeah. and shops for those of you who love shopping i love window shopping not actually buying anything <laughs> why are you laughing well they have nowhere to put it <laughs> exactly well you know what we We've been here enjoying this park for about half an hour and I think it's time to move on. Really? I'm not done. I know. She wants to stay here all day, but it's time to go, guys. So. Aww. You've been with me all along. All along. All right, so we made it to Buena Vista. It's a small little restaurant nestled right on the cliff's edge where you overlook the ocean, the highway, the rest of the city. The views are ridiculously beautiful up here. And I'm excited because we got the best seats in the house. In the house, yeah, we did. So, <laughs> so yeah. we're just gonna get a couple burgers, fries, something Yum. to drink, and hang out here for another hour or so, rest our feet, and then we'll move on. But this is the spot. You've been holding on. Oh, 